Joran van der Sloot, the main suspect in the unsolved 2005 disappearance of American teenager Natalie Holloway, is en route to the United States to face extortion and wire fraud charges, according to Peruvian Interpol. Van der Sloot was handed over to the FBI on Thursday morning in Peru, where he had been serving a 28-year sentence for the 2010 murder of 21-year-old Stephanie Flores. Van der Sloot faces federal extortion and wire fraud charges in the U.S. stemming from accusations that he tried to profit from his connection to the Holloway case. In March 2010, Van der Sloot contacted Holloway's mother and claimed he would reveal the location of the teen's body in exchange for $250,000, with $25,000 paid up front. It, during a recorded sting operation, Beth Holloway's attorney, John Q. Kelly, met with Van der Sloot at an Aruba hotel, giving him $10,000 in cash as Beth Holloway wired $15,000 to Van der Sloot's bank account. Van der Sloot then allegedly changed his story about the night he was with Natalie Holloway, claiming that she died after he threw her down and her head hit a rock. Van der Sloot claimed that his father buried Natalie Holloway in a house and provided the location, but the information was worthless. Within days, Van der Sloot left Aruba for Peru, 